At time now 642, new electronic reading devices that are supposed to make it easier for the city to accurately get your water meter reading remotely are causing huge headaches and astronomical water bills for Houston customers. Investigative reporter Amy Davis has been digging into these water department issues, leaving you drained. She's here now with uh, what to do even if you haven't gotten a big bill yet, Amy. Yeah, we keep doing these stories and warning people because if you haven't gotten one, it's likely you will. So important, if you have your Houston water account on auto pay, you really should check it today. The city is replacing old, outdated electronic reading devices on thousands of meters. You're not going to get any notice before they come to your neighborhood. And customers who had their device replaced a few weeks ago were shocked when they got their latest water bills. I think this, this has changed. This is all new. Rick Naranjo is no water meter expert, but he can point out what looks different in his box. A few weeks ago, he noticed workers attaching these devices on the meter lids, and the register that shows his meter reading was also replaced. But it was his family's next water bill that really got his attention. Check it out. The city says he owes more than $23,600. I could see maybe a 400, 300, but 24,000? I said, that's like a car if I'm buying a new car. His neighbors in Kirkwood South and the Sagemont area were also shocked. Jessica Sanchez's bill it is a lot more than we were expecting is more than $2,600. Robert Tomlinson next door is looking at a bill for 5447 bucks. I mean, I would have to have a, a geyser coming out my backyard in order to have a bill that high. They each reached out to the water department. They basically told her that they would do an investigation on it. Then we'd have to call back in 27 days to figure out what's going on. I told my wife, like, why are we having to call back if it's their mistake? Houston Public Works told us it is aware that replacing remote meter reading devices has resulted in some customers seeing automatically generated bills in the thousands of dollars. Houston Public Works apologizes for the stress and confusion created by these erroneous bills. What workers are installing are these new reading devices. They'll transmit your meter reading back to the water department. We've told you how Houston Public Public Works says most of the reading devices on meters now were installed in the 90s. They don't work anymore. The city is replacing all of them over the next few years, but they're already two years behind schedule because of supply chain delays. Public Works hasn't told us exactly where they're installing the new devices first. We know from these customers that Sagemont received some, and customers near I-10 and Eldridge have also. Naranjo rushed home last week when a neighbor let him know a water department employee was looking at his meter. When he arrived, Naranjo says the city employee told him he had a leak because the dial on his meter was spinning. And I said, well, for your information, I just left. I said, and my dishwasher's running. So he already made the note. He had already called the city telling them we had a leak before he even talked to me. And Naranjo says that same employee told him he was circling back to fix dozens of reading devices a third-party contractor had installed incorrectly. Meanwhile, he and his neighbors wait for the city to correct their bills while they figure out what went wrong. Take care of it on your end. You know there's a mistake. You know, we're just trying to make a living like everybody else. And I understand they are too, but that's their job. So as these reading devices are attached to meters that haven't been actually read in years, you may be shocked when you receive a bill for five or 10,000 gallons of water because you're just not used to paying for actual water usage. I asked Houston Public Works if they plan to back bill customers for water that they were not previously billed for or if they just plan to get a current usage moving forward. The city hasn't yet answered that question. That's the important question. So what do we right. do so we're not surprised? Well, so most importantly, a lot of people have no idea how much water that they're being billed for or how much they use. So go online, check your water usage history, and you should go ahead and download and save your past bills so you can see the amount of water you've been using. In some instances, as these devices are replaced on meters, customers are telling us that their usage history is removed from their accounts. So if you haven't saved it before, saved your old bills, you don't know how much water you've been using and how much you've paid for it in the past. Yeah, but I think you definitely know, like that one customer said, I'd have to have a geyser in right. the backyard <laughs> yeah. right, to pay for that much yeah. water. But then when he goes to, to show the city like how much he's been paying for, he's like, I don't know, my bill right. was about this much. Right, right. You know? so you gotta have that, yeah. well, you'd like to have, have that, that proof. proof. Right. right. Yeah. Okay. All right, Amy, thank you. Mm -hmm.